we got us us five here. Um, we just kind of go over some stuff again. Um, going to be twenty nine fifty, um, and that'll be an annual cost. That is the lowest cost they offer. Um, some stuff that, like as far as finances go, I was talking about running revenue reports per facility. Um, you know, eliminates human error, which is nice. Uh, all the online payments are like backed, um, audit protected, and then just some, you know, some stuff that we can do easily. We got the group emails. That's for that's for all of us. That's for coaches, um, etc. Um, Signups, camps, trips, all this stuff can be done. So even if like you know Mrs. Sasatsky and uh, you know Whaley, whoever wants to go to a Red Sox game, like we can book that trip and do all that on rec desk. So that's kind of cool. Um, people can reserve facilities so we can keep a easier track of uh, the pavilion. I think it's going to help next year with. Uh, like adding additional baseball and softball games um, just because we're going to have such a visible thing for everybody. Um, and then, yeah, the, that's another thing is I think we ought to try and take on some more summer baseball stuff. Um, but that's a topic for another day. Um, what else? Younger generations with parents, just like we were talking about. Um, and then, so we all, you know, we're all on the same page with all the benefits we have and, and all that kind of good stuff. Um, and then this was my plan to finance it. Um, we could do a, a five to $10 increase in registration fees. Um, and me and Wayne were talking about numbers. We were thinking like 150, um, 150 annual registration. So you put that up $10 each. And uh, we're looking at fifteen hundred bucks. So just immediately, that's you know that's half. Um, now at the same time, Shelly, I don't like as someone who has you know who has kids in the system. So like, if you're paying ten extra dollars, like, is that a pain in the butt? Absolutely you? not. And that was actually what sold me on on this was your breakdown of how to finance that. Yep. Um, so yeah, I and I have been speaking to some parents, and they absolutely are for like ten dollars. Okay. I don't think there'll be an issue at all. Is that Max? Is that Max? Chris. Well, I was, it is Max, right? Uh, no, Chris Williams. Oh, Chris, I thought you were one of the town employees over there. A new hire, huh? Uh, no, that's not okay. me. Wrong person. But anyways, would you folks please lock up, shut the lights up? Yeah. I don't want to hear in five minutes. I'm going to just please off my, my lap. I'm sorry for the interruption. Yeah, you got it. All right, thanks, sir. Okay, thank you. You too. Okay, um, so yeah, that's reassuring that parents can be good with that. Um, and then the other thing was the over 30 week. Those guys are playing three games a week, um, and they're doing that for over four months. So we're currently charging them 50 bucks a game. We're going to up that to 65. Um, so we're looking at, you know, Minimum seven hundred and twenty dollar uh, additional revenue up to nine hundred dollar revenue, and that's in teacher math. So I'm sure we're we're somewhere in that ballpark. Um, oh, and then the other thing, uh, sponsorship. So I put a thousand bucks in parentheses here. I was thinking that might have been a little confusing um, because of the way I like organized it below. But I was thinking like our goal should be like a pretty set at a thousand bucks. And then sort of divvy it up. So, like, if we have, you know, Pachesnik's and Norris or something, and they both want to give 500 bucks, well, then, like, all right, hey, you guys get the site kind of thing. But if we have 10 companies who want to do 100 bucks, we could do the logos all over. So, I think that was kind of like send out some feelers and, you know, see what we can get. But I, I do, I'm very confident we'll get a thousand bucks in sponsors. Um, you know, when you add up all that money, you know, we're we're there. We're over. We're over where we we're we're in the green. We're over three grand. Um, so, yeah. And the guy who I was talking to for the company, he was saying that we expect a fifteen percent 
increase in revenue. And that wasn't including like pumping up prices on stuff. That was including like more people um, having that access and all that kind of stuff. Um, so we'll see. Yeah, no, I like it. I like it. And waiting for like Waitley, Waitley Wolves beer can, has that been profitable in the past? Like, Purchased it? I have. No, not purchased it. Well, like, I don't know what you call it. It usually it sits in the in, in the school in the entryway, and that's it. And like, that's it. So that's could be another. Yeah. Revenue, yeah, you know what I mean? If you've got it out on maker, the website, like, um, there the more people see it. it online. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yep. I can't Absolutely. think of a word is, but yeah. Adver yeah. Advertise? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> you know what I mean? It <laughs> just kind of sits there. People and, aware? And we just mail right to them too, you know. And we can do like I know for baseball we do Atlantic Sportswear. Um, that's like our big thing. And we get hooked up with Under Armour, Nike, Champion, anything we could ever want. Um, so if we were going to do something like that, then we could post that online and people could purchase it right through our like they'd have a link to that on our website, so they can just click and it would be great. Yeah, we can post anything. Um, Okay. So I guess if you want to vote, <laughs> um, and yeah, we'll all like we'll all have the password to it, and um, and we'll just I guess I'll do his <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Sorry. Yeah. So I guess um, my vote would be uh, yes. You should do it right. Somebody's going to make a motion. Okay. I make a motion to vote on the sports software. Somebody should second that. I second that motion. Yeah. And because it's Zoom, you got to do a, what do they call it, a roll call vote? You got to say your name and vote. Oh. You want me to say my name and vote? Yeah. Okay, Justin Davis, and uh, I vote yes. Yeah. Should I do? I have to log this way. Is this like official? What do we? Yeah, I, I'm just. All right, all right. Yeah, so Justin, yes. Yeah. So okay, no, people. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. We got three votes today. Justin and Chris, I'm a yes as well. Yeah, I vote yes. Jake. Jake Schrader vote yes. All right. <laughs> Can you hear us, Jake? I couldn't hear you guys when I was on Zoom. Can you hear me now? I can hear you. Can you hear us? Yeah, I can hear you guys. <laughs> I feel like we were also like sitting back here like mumbling through. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so who do we have one more? Or is that it? That's it. All right, so the vote is unanimous. It's a yes. Yeah. So um, I'm going to get in touch with that guy immediately. Um, he said we'll have it right at like as last, you know, as late as possible for the start of soccer season. You know, like we'll get it in kind of thing. Um, so my plan is to use whatever we have to get info out to let parents know, like, hey, be prepared. This is coming, but, like, don't fret in the meantime. Like, we have this. So Mary will just blast an email out. Like, we can, I can do, like, a Word document. Docker registrations are on its way. It's all going to be done through this software. Okay. And like maybe if you're interested in coaching, like shoot yeah. me an email. Yeah. Okay. Is there an option on that when they're registering their kid yeah. to like check so a box? You want. Check a box that okay. says check um, a box for coach or for assistant coach. Yeah. Yep. Yep. And we can even like, and then based on that, we can log those coaches immediately. So that'll be good. And then I think something that was super beneficial, um, speaking with parents in the area. Was that, and I know that baseball is your wheelhouse, but that baseball clinic for coaches, because I know that that 
did motivate a lot of parents who were reluctant because yep. they didn't know what to do to, to get involved. Um, so, I mean, if we can potentially do those coaching clinics, I think it'll help with the volunteers as well. Yeah. Yep. And that's, you know, and that would be just such a great thing about this. It's like the registration crap, which can be such a headache. Like we're going to get through this super quick. And I'm like, okay, now I have more time to like, I can go, okay, we got sock, like we have our soccer coaches, like, Hey, I'm going to reach out, reach out to the frontier coach or maybe so-and-so knows so-and-so we can, you know, spend more time organizing that kind of stuff, which is going to get parents more excited, kids more excited. Um, so I think that's, you know, as far as organization goes, it's awesome. But then the benefits to spend time on other stuff is going to be, that's going to be good. So, yeah. But, good stuff. All right. Good stuff. Sweet deal. Well, that's it. Justin, Nick, I appreciate it. All right. Thanks, guys, for putting that together. You got it. Well, uh, keep everybody in the loop moving forward. Thank you, guys. And yeah, great job putting that together. Appreciate it. All right. Thanks for the help. All right. All right. Thanks.